A new year means another legendary ball drop in Times Square. And it wouldn't be New Year's Eve without Ryan Seacrest and Jenny McCarthy, who braved the wild weather to put on one heck of a show. Does anything stop you guys? And nothing will stop us, and nothing stops the millions of people that come out to watch this in person as well. They host Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve and are blown away by how many people come out super early to get a good spot for the big occasion. They have to wait hours due to increased security. These are people who in their real lives have no lack of commitment because they commit for 12 hours right. to be in the same spot spot until the ball drops. This is a bucket list experience you have to do once, so why not? This year promises to be extra special, especially for McCarthy, because her husband Donnie Wahlberg will be performing with New Kids on the Block. Nine years ago was my first time hosting New Year's Eve, and Donnie performed with New Kids, and he said, hi, Jenny McCarthy. I said, hi, Donnie, and that was it. Now I'm married to him, and he's performing, so it's going to be very sentimental. What are they going to do on stage, Gina? I do know. She, know. she knows the moves and everything. Oh, my God, it's going to blow everyone's mind. It's right, extra right. special, I'll tell you that. But, of course, with all those partygoers in one contained area, there's always concerns about how to keep them safe. Do you have concerns this year? I never think about it. NYPD is so good. They're the best in the world. And I think that uh, they have it covered as they do every year. I feel safest in Times Square on New Year's Eve than anywhere else. They say they're just looking forward to having a good time and marking the new year with all of America. Let's have some good laughs this new yeah. year, right? Hey.